What's up, Ninstars? This is Trail Mix Blazer. Welcome back to Let's Play Mario Superstar Baseball. In the previous episode, we played an exhibition game to learn how to play this game. And now, in this episode, we are going to begin challenge mode, the single player mode, in an attempt to take down Bowser. So let's get right to it. We're gonna start a new game from the start. Where else would you begin the game? We're gonna play on the mushroom level, which is the easiest level, but it's the only level unlocked at the end at the uh, beginning of the game. And as you can see, we have five different team captains to choose from, each with different starting teams. Uh, for this playthrough, I'm going to play as Mario's team. And we're going to get a little intro video here. Baseball's all the rage lately with Mario and his pals. Every day, the gang gets together and has great fun. Except for War Wario. Though he missed! But one day, a curious letter floated down from the sky. Bowser sent a letter of challenge. Time to play me, but why bother? I'll obviously win with my Wario voice! Somehow, I am Wario, even though I am Bowser. Wow, that'd be a plot twist. Wario, <laughs> Bowser is actually Wario in disguise. That would be a major plot twist of the Mario games. Anyway, basically, that's uh, Nintendo's half-baked way of trying to get a story into this game. Anyway, let's see. Hello there, Mario. Is your team ready? Uh, yes. Bowser craves a test of his mind. He wishes to play a powerful team. Let's see. You have... Piantas, Noki's, multi Mole, and your brother? Well, yeah, of course. Why wouldn't I have my brother? No offense, but uh, I'm a bit worried about your lineup. Well, guess what, buddy? I'm not. I'm quite satisfied with my lineup right now, although we're going to improve. Are you sure this is the team you want for now? Yes, but I'm going to improve this team. Yeah, fine, as long as you're sure, but just let me fill you in on some details. Your rivals are forming teams, too. Beating all the other teams should earn you a date with Bowser team. Bowser's team, yes. We are going to be playing against each of the other four teams uh, that you saw at the beginning of this uh, challenge mode. Even rival team members might help you out if you can impress them. That is a major component of this game. The thing is, of course, you can only play with up to nine players, as per the rules of baseball. So be sure to challenge Bowser with your best team of nine. Best of luck. All right. So this is the challenge mode map. As you can see, we can move around it, and uh, there's plenty of places to see. This is our home stadium, Mario Stadium. Uh, that's the stadium we played the exhibition game in. And, uh, yeah, let's just walk around here. If we uh, walk across this bridge and over here, uh, there's a little island. There's plenty of things to do here, but I think the very first thing I'm going to do is uh, play our first game. Let's go over here to this windmill, talk to it, and hey, look, it's Yoshi. Yahee! Yahee? That translates to, Hey Mario, do you want to play against my team? Um, okay. How it's able to do that in just two syllables, I have... Or four syllables, I have no idea. But let's start the game already! What? Bonus points to anyone in the comments who can give me that reference. So, yahee! Let's play ball. And a bunch of cute Yoshi faces. Ah, the cuteness and birds! Okay. So... Uh, this is our lineup. Let's go ahead and set it up. I'm going to go ahead and swap the positions. These are the only players we have access to, but as you can see, we're going to be able to um, recruit other players on our team eventually. Uh, we're not able to do that right now, but I will explain what that means in just a moment. Let's see. I had my lineup set up for this. Uh, as you can see, the Piantas on our team are real good at batting and okay at fielding, but... Uh, Pretty poor everywhere else. Now, Monty Mole is one of our players. He is strong at running. His special talent is ball dash, meaning that he will be able to run very quickly um, when he gets the ball in the infield. So he can be really useful. Not a great hitter, though. Real good at fielding and running, though. Uh, the Piantas are all good at batting. Their special ability is laser beam, which means they will throw the ball in the field faster. Each of these Nokis, uh, really fast, but um, not so great in anywhere else. Their special ability is just a sliding catch. That's really the most generic of all of the special abilities. 
Then, of course, we got good old Luigi. Strong point might. I don't really know what that means, honestly. Special talents are wall jump and super jump. Uh, basically, he'll be able to jump onto a wall and catch a home run ball. I've never actually been able to do it myself, but it's really cool. Um, now, you'll notice here, the star pitch and star swing for Luigi and Mario, even though they are star players, um... They are not the fireballs like they normally are. That's because in challenge mode, you have to unlock those. You have to be able to pay for the item in order to um, get those special abilities. So we're not able to get those right now. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much our team. I'm going to go ahead and set this up. I have one of the peons to catcher. I have another one at first base. Uh, let's see, I think I'm going to stick one out in the outfield, and we're going to have a couple of Nokis there. We're going to have Monty Mole at second, because that would be a good place to, for, to have him. And we're going to have Luigi up in left field. Um, I'm actually going to stick two Nokis out there. We're going to have Piantas all across the field. Yeah, I think that looked pretty good. All right. Now, scout flags. This is the important part of challenge mode. Random scout missions will pop up during the game. You'll see when they come up. They'll show flags. And um, every time one of those pops up, you will get a chance to earn a flag. You have to complete the mission. It'll say something like, strike the batter out or get a hit or something. And, and if you successfully complete that mission and during that at bat, you will earn a scout flag, and that will draw the player closer to your team. Uh, for those of you who want to see, there's my lineup again real quick, and there's my fielding. Um, I'm trying to make sure that the Piantas and the Nokis are batting right, one right, run right. I can't talk! One right after the other, so that um, they will have good chemistry with each other, especially the Nokis who can't hit very well. There are the settings, there are my control options. Let's do this. Welcome again to the world of Mario Superstar Baseball. Here we are at Yoshi Park, the Mario Sunshines versus the Yoshi Islanders. Okay, so we're playing at Yoshi Park. Yoshi Park's outfield, I've noticed, is kind of deep. And the, and the quirk to this one is there are piranha plants in the outfield. Okay, Monty Mole is going to be our leadoff hitter. He fouls off the first pitch. We're going to wind up for another one, and we're going to hit it straight to Yellow Shy Guy. I'm going to bang on Bay, try to... Bang on Bay? No. Bang, bang on A, and uh, I totally missed. Yeah, the Bay button. I don't think there's a Bay button on this controller. And uh, Luigi gets on first. Excellent. We got a runner on. Oh, wow. We get a mission now. We have to score a run on this, uh, I think just in this inning. And uh, there's a good way to do it. Mario hits a deep fly ball to right center. Luigi's going home. We're going to try to get a challenge flag for all these players, and yes, we will. We have gotten the one for Birdo and one for Baby Luigi and Yoshi as well. I would really like Birdo. That's the one challenge flag we have to get for Birdo. Um, some players require more challenge flags. Now, if you get all the challenge flags for the captain, then you beat, then you beat the team completely, and uh, the captain becomes a member of your team. And you're not able to face that team anymore. Mario, go back to second. That's the one thing that really ticks me off about this game is the base running. The base runners will automatically run no matter what's happening. And uh, Red Noki is now up. He needs to get a hit in order for to get another challenge flag for Yoshi. The second one. And uh, yes, he will get a hit. And uh, he's not going to go for second because I don't want to risk it. I want to get that challenge flag. So there we go. We got two challenge flags for Yoshi. And I really want Yoshi on my team eventually. Because uh, Mario and Yoshi have good chemistry. So we're now up to nothing. Red Noki is on first. I'm actually going to steal with him. And uh, I'm safe. Barely. And uh, I should have mentioned these games are three innings. Uh, okay. Piazza hits one deep, deep, deep. And it's foul. Of course. Oh, Yoshi throws a star pitch, which I do not have. That is not fair. Oh, uh, whatever. I'm still up to nothing. All right, let's strike Yoshi out. We're going to throw him a slow ball. And now we'll give him a fast ball. 
Um, let's give him another change up because the AI has a terrible time hitting the change up for some reason. I should be able to make quick work of these guys. Let's see what happens here. Baby Luigi, by the way, is a terrible hitter. I do not want Baby Luigi on my final team. I'm going to get Birdo already because I already have one challenge flag and I really want to get another one for Yoshi because I would love to be able to beat Yoshi in just one game. Uh, there are certain players that I have in mind for my final team. Uh, and if I do not get those players, then I will be playing the teams again to get the specific player that I want. Yoshi is going to be one of those players, I will say that right now, because Mario and Yoshi have very good chemistry. And here we go, we might get our chance to get Yoshi now. Now, these challenge flags only stay if you win the game. So I have to win this game in order to get these challenge flags. So I really want to get a hit here, and I need to beat this out. I don't think I'm going to get it. Nope. Oh, well, I'll get another chance later on. That's the one problem, though. The challenge missions or the scout missions, they seem to pop up randomly. So some games you may not get very many at all. And then there are other games where you will get a ton of challenge flags all at once. I don't know why that is. It's just the way the game developers decided to make it. All right, and Yellow Pianta strikes out. Just dandy. Okay. Green Noki for a, with a star chance, but since we don't have any star abilities right now, um, that's kind of meaningless for us. Green Noki is going to get on first. And with Monty Mole coming up, I think it would be a good idea to try to steal with Noki. Safe. Every time I get a speed player, Noki is a speed player, I try to I try to steal second because um, it's a good idea to get a runner on second. So that way, if I get a hit to the outfield, it's a pretty easy hit. So Monty Mole on first, and I will go ahead and steal with him again. I'm gonna just, just going to try to run up the score here just a little bit. There we go. We got Monty Mole on second base. Excellent. Uh, Luigi... Gets a base hit, and... Or does he? No, he's out, barely. Alrighty. We're going to the bottom of the second inning. Uh, let's see if we can get some more challenge flags. I really want to get that challenge flag for Yoshi, I'm telling you. So while I'm striking these guys out, I will just say... The baseball playoffs are getting underway right now. I highly recommend watching them. I am really, really excited about the baseball playoffs this year. Um... I just really think that this year in particular is especially exciting because I think all 10 teams that are in the playoffs, or that made the playoffs, I should say, um, I think they all have a chance to win the World Series, honestly. I'm really, really excited to see what happens. Uh, now, by the time this video is up, uh, a couple of those teams are probably eliminated already, but still... I'm really, really excited about the Major League Baseball playoffs, and I highly recommend watching them if you aren't if you uh, aren't already. And that was a quick one, two, three inning for the Mario Sunshines. We're up three nothing going into the third inning. We'll see that in the next episode. See you guys then.